Hello guys, this is Russian Alex again, and um, today I want to show you something uh, different. It's not going to be a video, but it's just going to be some basic things. But I really like it because you know the optic, uh, the optic wireframe effect. I've been watching some optic videos, and I've been watching other people posting videos uh, close to optic, like sniping, and it seems they have been using the effect of wireframe rendering like it looks like it renders the actual wireframes but in reality it's just like the actual text with that kind of effect on it so let's get started open up cinema 4d I don't mind this I have my intro on here because I was trying to make it a little better open cinema 4d up and uh, make a new project okay so first before we get to the text or anything you need a material it really doesn't matter what kind of material you need because well let's just say for me the the wider the material is the better the more like mechanic um, metallic colored it looks so for example I'm gonna choose this material right here you can choose any material you want because that does that's not gonna matter really and then you turn on glow the inner strength make 70 and then the outer strength make 120 the radius you can make let's say 8 and that's pretty much it material has been done so what we need to do now is make a text let's just say we make uh, Russian Alex ugh, have slip on Russian Alex rocks wow look how it's spelled rocks that's embarrassing on my side. Okay, now we'll just turn on turn around the text so we can see it. Uh, I don't want to center it in the middle because uh, I'm not doing it for a video or anything. So let's just say Russian Alex rocks. Here it is. So depth of it. Let's see something so you can see the depth. Let's make it 140 maybe. Mm, 124. That's that's good enough. And then let's line the height maybe 179 yeah 179 is perfect see right now it looks like just bad letters easiest thing to do in the world that so yeah so now you want to put the material on it the glow it's nothing nothing fancy really it's just gonna glow a lot and it's look it's gonna look pretty pretty much a little bit cooler but that's not what we need right now now, what you want to do is go to this and click Atom Array. Then drag the text into Atom Array. As you can see, it starts to, to develop that wireframe rendering right here. But then you want to put the material on Atom Array also. It's going to make it the same kind of uh, color as the text was before. So that's pretty much it for Atom Array and it's a pretty cool effect it all depends on what color you're using though because for example here it looks like I have a little bit too much glow so I can change it to 113 maybe and what am I doing 113 and maybe 66 and then if you look now it's probably gonna make a small difference yeah it does make a small difference and the atom array you can change the actual radius of it so make it uh... three so it doesn't look fat and cylinder probably make it one and it's gonna look skinnier so that's what we really need and then you can just animate it now of course i don't need to show you the tutorial on how to animate it because that's stupid and um, from here on from here on you can just like do whatever you want with the text and play with it and uh, look at it so that's pretty much it guys and I advise you to make the br the the brighter the color the better because it's going to look better and 
you see right now it's going to look brighter a lot brighter right now and it it gives it like a more um electronic look and not like a 3D letters look but if you do it this color this is what I don't like my f one of my favorite colors is lime green and I put it on lime green this and it looks just like way colorful for me I don't want this see so yeah so this is pretty much it on the tutorial and hope you guys like it and rate comment and subscribe guys because well this wasn't really time consuming I didn't really take much time figuring this out and I watched a couple of things and I knew the Adam Array effect and you can actually animate it and it's gonna look pretty cool you're gonna have some pretty cool figures so yeah and um that's pretty much it guys so if, tell me if you want more and comment rate and subscribe I might give you the fireflies effect for optic gaming next time so ask me I'm up for it. Peace.